Welcome back to Energy and Cleaning and Life Hacks. Do you have a ton of these masks laying around your house? I don't know about you, but I sure do. And I feel bad just throwing them and tossing them in the garbage. So I have a clever, genius hack for you about why you should always be hanging your used or new, if you'd like, face mask on your doors. You can also do this in your car. Yes, let me show you exactly what you need to do. First things first, you're gonna cut off the top of your face mask and then once you do that it's going to open up this is two ply so there's a layer inside and you're going to get a really nice sachet then the next thing that you're going to do is you are going to fill your face mask with can you guess dun 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 some baking soda baking soda is amazing because it absorbs smells it absorbs moisture so you could do this in your bathroom by your toilet and it's kind of cute hanging there. And then there's an absolute must I'm going to share with you in just a second that I would highly recommend that you do, especially if you have a used face mask before you do this. And then what I like to do to my baking soda is I like to add something a little yummy, some essential oil right here. I'm everything lemon lately. Before it was eucalyptus and it was lavender, but now I'm all about the lemon. You certainly don't have to use any essential oils if you don't want to. You could put a dryer sheet in there. That smells nice. You could also put some baby oil or pure vanilla extract, anything that you find pleasing to yourself. All right, here's the one thing that I recommend that you do. Oh, by the way, you would just go ahead, hang this on your door. And every time you open the door, or you're in your bathroom, the smells, disgusting smells will be absorbed, but it will smell delicious because of whatever fragrance that you use inside in combination with that baking soda. So here's what you wanna do. In here, you can use vinegar. I have alcohol. I prefer the alcohol. You can use vodka if you have an old thing of vodka laying around, although I don't really think that vodka goes bad. You're gonna wanna spray your old face mask and let them sit for a little while, dry out before you put in your baking soda, cut off the top. This is what it looks like, by the way, once you've cut off the top, you clip here where it attaches around your ear. That way you can tie a nice knot at the bottom that you see here. But I would want to sanitize and disinfect these face masks, especially if I'm going to be reusing them. So that's why I prefer the rubbing alcohol all over the mask and then do this trick right here. If you're looking for some clever additional face mask hacks that you can use around your house and home to impress your friends and family, click the video on screen now. Give this video a thumbs up. Sign up for the free weekly cleaning hack newsletter so that you'll be the first to know. And I will see you, my friend, in the next one.